you know, I'm here for the first time after being here 11 years ago shooting sequences of my most famous film, War Photographer, and I'm showing Space Risk, my newest work, and I'm giving a workshop to, I think, young filmmakers, and I'm, you know, really liking to do that. And the workshop is basically on aspects of filmmaking, decisions you have to do as a documentary filmmaker, and, uh, yeah. Eleven years ago, I was here in Brisbane shooting the introduction of my most famous film, War Photographer. It, war Photographer is about James Nachtwey, the most famous, most courageous war photographer in history. And he was in 1999 shooting, you know, photographing the war in Kosovo, and I was following him. So for me, it's very emotional to be here again. I'm also very glad to be here again because uh, I won already twice this festival with War Photographer and the Giant Buddhas showing now space tourists and I'm really happy to be here and presenting the film myself because I was never at DocuFest before. Space tourists is about space tourism of course, about this eternal fantasy of mankind that you can take your family and the dog and the children and instead of going to the beach you go to outer space. And uh, Space Tourist is, I think, a very surprising film, a very funny film, also a poetic film, because it shows you aspects which you would never expect in the field of space exploration. It's not another just rocket movie. You see a film where you are sometimes on the ground with stories you would never believe, like the story of Kazakh people making a living out of space debris and you watch the film and you think about the Earth because you are leaving the Earth and you have the story of the first female space tourist Anusha Ansari, she's my main protagonist and she is in the film uh, very important because also she was uh, you know in space shooting herself the, like the every day is living in outer space so it's very important well I just arrived in prison but obviously of course this city changed a lot and I'm very happy about it. Even though, you know, there is other, there is still a quarter of Serb uh, living and is, it's destroyed now, so it is still contradictory and it's still, you can feel there is conflicts, but I like the fact that at this festival people come together, people from all over the world, but also from all over Balkans and working together because this, I think, is the beginning of reconciliation, which is so important.